Anyway, he hired this guy. <clears throat> Out of the goodness of his heart. This guy just got here from Cuba. Apparently, he spent the first five years of his life being raised by spider monkeys in the jungles of Cuba. He was found by some Christian missionaries. And they got him they got him over here. Doesn't speak much English. But he's got a special talent. He can he can climb anything, get his hands around. That's kind of why Zach hired him. That body shop he's got. Ceilings are like 30 feet tall. And he just keeps them around and nothing else. Change light bulbs. But anyway, they caught the guy. know how much time he's going to do, if he's going to get deported. I do kind of feel sorry for him. According to those Christian missionaries, he spent, like I said, five years in the jungle. Lived off nothing but root beer and chips and boy cookies. The monkeys would steal for him. Made his arms kind of fragile from lack of calcium but you know he's got to get acclimated he's got to get acclimated to society he can't use that five years in the jungle as a crutch all his life I know he tried cage fighting for a while that didn't work out kept throwing feces at his opponent whatever yeah, it's been a rough night. I'm going to run over here and talk to Uncle Ray Ray. You know, in times like this, you, know, it, you, you need some support. And that's what that's what us cougar hunters do, you know. It's, it's just a web of support. But I've always looked up to him. So I'm sure he'll... You'll know exactly what to say.